pilot has been taken to hospital after crashing his plane off the coast of the popular seaside resort of Port Call. He managed to make it to dry land following the crash, which happened at around half past nine this morning. Our correspondent Dean Thomas Welch is there for us now. Dean, just how close was this crash to being more serious? Fly on the coastline of uh, Port Core, uh, just metres from where a dramatic uh, plane crash happened this morning. Let me just show you exactly where. Liam behind the camera can just zoom in for me here. So just behind me, about 100 yards, you'll see a boy floating on the water. Underneath that is the plane. That is where the plane went into the water. So you can see just how incredibly close it was to the rocks here on Port Core uh, seafront. If the plane had landed on the rocks instead of in the water, we'd be talking about a completely different story this evening. But eyewitnesses report seeing a plane struggling uh, in the air at low altitude uh, with its engine stuttering and then no diving into the water. And eyewitnesses told us what they saw. I could see this plane coming in at a very low angle and attitude. It was probably no more than about 100, 150 feet off the ground or something like that. I began to hear the engine splutter and stutter. And very soon, within a few seconds or so, it had died altogether. So Dean, what happens next then? Yes, well, one of the first emergency crews on the scene was the RNLI. Now, they tell us uh, this is now a salvage operation. They've got to wait for the tide to go out and for the plane to re-emerge before they can drag it uh, into the shoreline. I've been on connected with the station for 35 years, and we haven't had an aircraft incident in that time. There historically have been flight aircraft that have crashed, but not in the last 35 years. And knowing the Welsh coast, they're relatively unheard of. So it is quite a, a unique experience. Well, the pilot miraculously walked away with minor injuries. Now, we have been told he did suffer some injuries to his legs, and he was taken to the Princess of Wales Hospital, where he's receiving treatment. But it's the skill of the pilot to land a plane on the sea, and not on the rocks, or on the houses and the businesses here in Port Coral. That means we're not talking about a tragedy this evening. Okay, Dean, thank you very much.